series I'm doing. I'm going to be bringing you playthroughs of uh, Wizard 101, starting from the beginning. Let's do this. We're going to create a new character. Aha! The spell is working. Look, Gamma. Finally, we have found one. Oh! A young wizard. A student with amazing potential. Enough, perhaps, to save Wizard City. Oh, really? Where? Oh, a very, very distant realm. Oh, my goodness. On a world that does not even believe in magic. I wonder what manner of wizard they might become. Perhaps we should consult the Book of Secrets. Headmaster Ambrose turns to regard you intently. Answer these questions to find out what type of wizard you are. Death Wizard, also known as Necromancer. We don't want to be a Death Wizard. We already have one. We're going to go ice. But now that we know what you are, what do you look like? What do I look like? Let's see. Identify as a joker. Wish to alter your appearance in the future? Simply pay a visit to the magic mirror shop in the shopping district. All right, then. What is your name? Well, hello, if it isn't our newest student. My name is Merle Ambrose. I am the headmaster of the Ravenwood School of Magical Arts. We're expecting great things from you, but first things first. To move around, use the arrow keys on your keyboard. Try it now. My owl friend would like to speak with you. Walk up to Gamma and follow his instructions to talk. Hello! My name is Gamma the Owl, and I am quite pleased to meet you. Let's go ahead and skip the tour of the And we're off. Welcome to Ravenwood Academy, young wizard. <laughs> And normally, this is where you'd be enrolled and sent to your classes. But times are not normal. There's some kind of supernatural incursion in Unicorn Way that must be dealt with immediately. I wonder... You've demonstrated such potential, I think practical experience will serve you better than lectures. Care to put your talents to the test? Splendid! Time is of the essence, so I'll teleport you there directly. Seek out Private Connolly, the wizard city guard in charge of that area. Welcome to Unicorn Way. There are creatures here who will attack you if you get too close to them, so stick to the task at hand. Whoa, 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 young student. The street's very dangerous right now. Is there something I can help you with? Wizard, do you see the symbol above Private Connolly's head? That means he has something important to tell you. Go speak with him. What's that? You say the headmaster sent you to help us? Well, then, you're just the person, oh, wizard, I've been waiting for. 
This used to be a pleasant street, but we've been invaded by hordes of strange creatures. The guards and I have been doing our best to push the creatures back, but we're no match for their dark magic, especially the undead. Maybe your fancy wizard magic will do the trick. Go battle a few of those lost souls, then report back to me. Good luck! To battle the monsters, run up to them on the street. When you get close enough to them, they will summon a combat sigil, and you will be pulled into combat. If you want to avoid battle, you can keep safe by staying on the sidewalk. If you can drive away some of these lost souls, we'll be in your debt. Transparent, you are safe from combat, but it only lasts for a short time. Get to the sidewalk before it wears off. That's turned the tide. We'll follow your lead and stop pushing these ghostly things back. But I'm worried we won't be able to drive the phantoms away for good without knowing why they're attacking us. We've got to find out what's behind this. Another intrepid student, Siri Nightchan, also came to help. Maybe he's learned something useful. Oh, hey there, I'm Saren. You're new here, aren't you? Well, I for one am very glad you're here. I couldn't help but notice how you took down those lost souls. I have to say, I'm quite impressed by your spell-slinging skills. Thank you, thank you. When I heard there was trouble on Unicorn Way, I rushed right over. But then I saw what's out there. Skeletal pirates. Skeletons I can handle, but skeletal pirates? Puh! Yar! No, thank you! Pirates give me the heebie-jeebies! Excuse me, did I hear you two talking about skeletal pirates? If you're going to face them, please come talk to me first. It would be good to know exactly what we're up against. Do you think you could battle a few skeletal pirates to see how tough they are? Great! I'll mark their location on your map. Thank you so much for doing this. Good luck! Ooh, press M to access your map. You'll notice several points of interest, including the locations of enemies. Because you'll be engaging in combat, it's imperative you know how to regain health and mana. If you need to boost your health, collect the red wisps you see along the street. Oh! If you need mana, collect blue wisps. Remember, casting spells costs mana, and fleeing combat drains it completely. So, go battle a few of the skeletal pirates on Unicorn Way. The guards will appreciate a report on their combat tactics. I'm glad I overheard you two wizards talk about those pesky skeletal pirates. They're looting the street and making such a mess. If something isn't done, we could be forced to leave the city. Please, will you help us? Olivia is offering you a side quest. Once you accept it, press Q to open your quest log. Quests marked with stars are part of the main story. Side quests are optional, but allow you to gain additional rewards. Good hunting.
hard. For that which rattles in the darkness. <laughs> oh, bless you, child. I don't have much to offer in thanks. But please, take this magic ring. Maybe it'll help you in your adventures. To put on new equipment, press B to open your backpack. You will see icons showing your hat, robes, shoes, and other items. Mousing over an item will compare its stats to what you currently have equipped. Select the best equipment available to your school. Thanks again, young wizard. Maybe I can find another helpful young wizard to help sweep up all these eye patches. Oh, wow! You made it back! I mean, uh, how'd it go? What did you learn? The pirates warned about a rattle in the darkness? See, this is what I was talking about. Pirates are always creepy and frustratingly vague. What is clear is that some evil magic has emerged here, and we're going to need more than a handful of guards to stop it. There is a powerful, ancient being who may be able to help us understand the dark forces we're facing, the wise seraph, Lady Aurel. Not only does Lady Ariel possess strong magic, she's also the Warden of the Fairies, and they keep her well informed. Perhaps she's heard something about this rattle in the darkness. Go speak with her in the hedge maze at the far end of Unicorn Way. Halt! What purpose brings you into our hedge maze? Forgive me, young wizard. These dark times make me leery of new faces. But now I see the light within you. We've much to discuss. The evil forces that loosed the undead upon Unicorn Way have also corrupted my precious fairies. Please, you must help them. Vile bone cages have appeared along Unicorn Way. They are filled with a mysterious dark magic that corrupts all fairy folk who venture near them. Dispel the dark magic in the bone cages, then bring me fairy dust from those it corrupted. It may reveal to me who is behind this atrocity. It pains me to say it, but the only way to obtain the fairy dust is to wrestle it from the dark fairies in combat. Try to be gentle. Once you've dispelled the bone cages and collected the fairy dust, return to me immediately. Good luck, young wizard. May the light guide you. Go. Tiny, joyful voice call your name. Thank you for helping us, kind wizard. Your courage and benevolence will not soon be forgotten by the fairy folk. You've cemented your reputation as a hero to the fairy folk, young wizard. With the bone cages dispelled, I can help the other corrupted fairies in time. Now we must root out who is behind this attack. Please, let me examine the fairy dust. Is that? But how? The fairy dust displays scars of a dark magic vanished from this world long ago. Could it be? Rattle in the darkness? Rattle bones. In life, a ruthless tyrant who was banished to the underworld for his crimes. If I focus, perhaps I can sense his location. 
Oh, so much darkness. No, my vision is obscured. All I see is a tower ringed in bones. Siren Nightchant knows Unicorn Way. Perhaps he can help. You must hurry. Here, take this broom. It will allow you to travel to Siren much faster. Now fly, and may the light guide you. You've received a tip. You must ride to Siren at once. Ask him if he knows of a tower ringed in bones. Go. Hello! You were gone for so long, I was beginning to worry you'd run off and joined a skeletal pirate crew. But what did Lady Oriel have to say? Oriel thinks an underworld tyrant named Rattlebones is behind all this? Wicked. Let me think. He's in a tower ringed in bones. Well, the skeletal pirates do seem to be concentrated around the old archives. Try looking there. Here, I'll mark it on your map. Good work, my thrall. This could be the tome Ballister seeks. Now we... What's this? A wizard? Excellent. I could use a combat break. Let's play. To leave, Rattlebones dropped the tome he was holding. It could be important. Perhaps Saren will know what should be done with it. To help but notice that the dark magic that was previously choking the street seems to have abated. You did it, didn't you? You beat Rattlebones! The darkness plaguing Unicorn Way is lifting! Look! With Rattlebones defeated, the guards should be able to drive away the rest of the undead horde. Ooh, that tome looks important. You should take it to the library in the commons. Harold Argleston will know what to do with it. 